is sparkling. And um, was just gonna go home, but um, I wanted to pull some cards from my fairies oracle and just um, kind of ground and um, uh, commune with the fairies a little bit. So it's, it's this this deck. It's the only deck I've ever worked with, and for whatever reason, the fairies asked that I share this. So I'm recording it for whoever might need it. Um, I don't normally share readings, but apparently I'm supposed to share this one, and I've learned through my years of working with fairy not to question them when they ask for something. Just going to pull three cards here. I'm going to flip this one first. Okay. So this is the Lady of the Harvest, I'll show you. There's a glare off of her. And let's see what the book has to say. What's the message from this card? I might just read a piece of it. Um, ah, so the language um, that the author chose for this card is in the description is um, completion, grief, loss, harvest, and release. The starter reading for this card says, it is time to accept change, to move to the next phase. Power and strength in the present and future come from releasing the past. This is a time of liberation, and we might as well cooperate with it. Um, let it go, yeah, which is um, sometimes really hard to do. Um, it will happen whether we want it to or not. Release and liberation may be painful or joyful depending on the circumstances. Cry if you need to, be joyful if that is appropriate. But in either case, trust the process, acknowledge what you feel, and prepare to move this one. This little um, piece of art was actually in the Fernie Bray where I used to sparkle for a while and it always made me really happy. So this says everyday blessings play and mixed blessing. This is also talking about play which I haven't been doing at all. Although wearing wings might kind of count. Michael can be foolish, silly, playful, and absurd. He's fond of goofing off and considers play to be an art form and himself a fine artist. He understands renewing the spirit and recreating the body and emotions. He knows that all of us have a child within who needs to play and be cherished. He also knows we need to make mistakes so we can learn from them, which is how he got the title of a mixed blessing. Don't be so caught up in thinking about the future that you can't see what's happening now. Welcome adventure into your life. Try something you've never done before and take a little time to play with Nickel before you turn into a grumpy, grumpy clump or a worn out word. <laughs> so, um, definitely we'll take that one to heart. So the last card here is, oh, a collective of pixies. We know this card very well. We know this collective. So the words pulled out for this card are duty, willingness, joyful participation and virtue. Pixies could treat their duty as something boring or oppressive, but they choose to take joy in doing it and doing it well. So that's a good message, right? Just to um, put joy in your work. I've been getting that message a lot lately. Little, little hints of it here and there. We've been trying to read some a little bit of self-help literature about like breaking bad habits and stuff. And a lot of it is just about mindset like what do you think of as work and why why are you avoiding something that you could just be doing because it's fun well <laughs> i mean my work is pretty fun but there's parts of my work that aren't like uh, yeah anyways start a reading <laughs> for the pixies um what is needed here is not only an awareness of duty but a merry approach to it there is something about this light-hearted approach to your duty that is important at this time in order to achieve the results you want Additionally, consider the words collective and cooperative as you make your plans. This situation may take more than one person. 
perhaps several working together to achieve the desired results. Joining forces with others is appropriate at this time. Seek the cooperation of friends, family, coworkers, and fairies as appropriate. Um, so none of these cards are in reverse. I feel like that in itself is saying that things are um, relatively good at the moment um, for at least me and whoever else this reading might be for. Let you look at the pixies one more time. Huge kiddos. So cute. It's four of them, right? That number's been coming up for me a lot too. I am going to close the reading with a little thank you. Thank you, fairies. Um, I'm going to do my best to absorb this and put it into action. Hopefully add a little bit of playfulness and a uh, little bit more present moment awareness. One day at a time you kind of feel vibe at the moment. So help you work towards, I don't know, fairies want to be sure. So if you enjoy, hope you're doing well. Um, thank you for coming and checking it out and Sorry about the sound quality, I still haven't figured out how to do a microphone with my iPhone. <laughs> Thank you for watching and I will see you in the realm.